Russell Kamer's Sacker Park was the location for a special event organised by the Public Works and Services Department, forming part of the UAE's second annual Innovation Week. So we are happy uh, to uh, try to break the record of the world uh, record of Guinness and the longest and uh, biggest uh, graffiti wall uh, in the world. Artists from across the region and beyond were invited to take part in creating the record-breaking attempt for the longest glow-in-the-dark graffiti wall. So the record that we are setting today requires us to produce a painting that glows in the dark and for that purpose we are using UV, the fluorescent and phosphorescent paints. So the start of the story is um, the, the, the sand, the sand of time, he's blowing the sand and we created, we discussed it and we decided to create a sense of movement. It's the beginning of the present. The artists work mostly at night in order to create the startling effects in their pieces which really glowed under the special lighting. And then the night itself, a spectacular stage setup and an audience of invited guests awaiting the arrival of the ruler of Russell Kama. His Highness Sheikh Saab bin Saka al Kazmi first toured the works of art and then took his seat for the start of this special ceremony to celebrate the unveiling of this enormous creation and its authentication by the Guinness World Record team. We have a new world record. Congratulations to us and him on the new world record for the largest glow in the dark painting. An impressive firework display brought the ceremony to a close. With congratulations all round to both artists and organisers for breaking the world record previously held by Japan, and one which Russell Kamer did in style. It means that my dream become true, which is we break the world, this, the world record of Genesis for the tallest and biggest graffiti wall. And I'm glad it's in UAE. You no, know, it's it's amazing. It's it's something that uh, you, you make your name, you make your mark on, on history, uh, and it's good to come here again and do this again. And with this amazing group of artists, group of organizers, uh, it feels really, really good. I'm happy. Fantastic! Everybody was happy. Everybody was enjoying this moment. So that's I want to bring to Ras Al Khaimah and to the population and to the locals here.